New at six, dozens of Miami-Dade police officers and trainees took part in an exercise designed to improve their response to a possible terror attack here. The exercise was scheduled before yesterday's truck attack in New York. Now keep in mind the video you're about to see is a simulation. CBS 4's Aurelia Ortega is live in the control room with more. Aurelia. Elliot, this is something that uh, law enforcement officials hope they never have to deal with, but something they say is necessary given the number of attacks we have seen recently. A chaotic scene as Miami-Dade police and Miami-Dade fire rescue personnel participate in a mass casualty and active shooter training exercise. They say it's all part of an ongoing commitment to ensure the safety of our community. In this particular exercise, it involved a call where a vehicle hit some pedestrians. In the dramatization that took place at their safety training institute in Doral, officers encountered bodies on the floor that were hit by a car. More than 100 MDPD police trainees participated as role players. As the officers arrived, that scenario continued to unfold where we had an active shooter. That event continued to evolve again with a second active shooter at another location. Wednesday's exercise was in the works long before Tuesday's terrorist attack in New York. But Miami-Dade police say they're always looking at what's going on around the world, like the Barcelona and Paris terrorist attacks, and catering their training to that. It's a skill that we have to be a master at. There's no time for mistakes. So we practice this to the point of mastery that when we're initially triaging a victim and then treating them, that we do it like if it's second nature. Miami-Dade police say they have done scenarios like this throughout the county at malls, government buildings, and stadiums. And once the exercise is done, more work lies ahead. It also gives our training staff an opportunity to see if there's any weaknesses, if there's any areas that we can improve. We're going to go back, we're going to critique this with the officers, we're going to critique it with our staff. And that's how they develop their training programs for the next training cycle so that when all the officers come in on their annual training, we can focus on things like this. Miami-Dade police say they hold training exercises as much as they possibly can at least two to three times a year. Live in the control room, Aurelia Ortega, CBS 4.